Aquarius, hello my loves and welcome back to the channel. Supreme gratitude for clicking on the video. We are going to see what messages you got coming in. You can have Aquarius in your sun, moon, rising, Venus, or North Node. Please hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell to all so you can be notified when I upload videos. I'm doing a few videos a day now. Turning up over here a little bit. Back just a little bit. Goals. Progress is positive and personal goals will be achieved. All right, Aqua. Let's get it. It's a good, it's a, we're coming into a good season, Aquarius, in finances. So, clearly decide what you want. Positive energy surrounds you. Love, joy, and good fortune awaits. trying to tell you I'm trying to tell you Golly. there's a bunch of cards flying out star your own energy hard times are over look forward to an abundance of happiness enthusiasm and positivity yeah yeah <laughs> proposal a romantic or business opportunity indicated okay I'm trying to tell you, Aqua. Good stuff. Big things popping, Aqua. Let's break this down. Make sure you like the video. Drop a comment below. I do offer personal readings. You can click the description box below. Go to my website and book your personal reading. Let's clarify goals. the collective Aquarius. Ooh. Five of cups in reverse. All right. Six of swords. Yeah. Four of cups. Yeah, the star card. Yeah, okay. With the magician at the bottom of the deck. Okay. Listen, <coughs> I feel like um, if you've been in a slump, if you've been, like, looking at things, revamping, um, grieving, just in a, in a somber energy, you're moving past that, okay? Um, I feel like... You didn't see, you, you weren't paying attention to why you were in this energy, but spirit was getting your attention, right? Um, spirit is coming in with an offer. You're not even going to catch it, right? I feel like you're so busy focused on what's in front of you that you're not looking at the bigger picture, but you are, okay? You are someone's wish fulfillment. You are the star. You do stand out. Your own energy is here within this day. So there's going to be some goals that you are about to reach. There's going to be some things that you have been manifesting that it's about to come through for you, okay? Things are about to turn around in your life, whatever it is, whether it's in love, whether it's in finances and career, okay? This is going to be a pivotal point. You're moving into um, a new a new energy. All right? Let's clarify the star. You got the star here twice in this. You got the star twice. Oh, man. Four came out. Boom. Boom. Okay. You got the star here twice. Okay, so you got the five of swords, the king of pentacles, the two of cups, and the king of swords, right? So someone here could have been, you know, um, trying to play like my manipulation. You may have felt as though you had to fight with someone, okay? You may have felt as though um, your money wasn't right, King of Pentacles, like, 
you were being defeated things were not turning around for you okay you may have been dealing with the king of pentacles right capricorn ties virgo or someone that's just in that energy someone that's financially stable folk or focus on their financial stability okay and this is your person two of cups king of pentacles two of cups king of swords this is you king of swords is you all right you you both are like aligning with your energy you both are coming to you know coming into one whoever this person is this is your soulmate with the star hard times are over some of you guys could have made a decision recently like you know what i'm, I'm focused i'm sticking with it yeah hard times are over you're coming into everything that you wanted with this person I see a lot of love here. You may have felt like this situation wasn't going in your favor. Boom. <laughs> As these popped out. King of Pentacles here. Queen of Pentacles is here. And the Temperance. You had to have patience. So that's probably the piece that you didn't see. Because, you know, Aquarius have patience. What? <laughs> the piece that you didn't see is that you had to have patience. And this was going to work itself out. Let's clarify proposal. Okay. So, like, for, for me in this proposal, I feel like your love life is ascending to a higher level. Yep. All right, you got the king of wands here. This person could have earth and fire in their chart. But balance is being restored here. This person is giving into the situation. I feel like you guys just came out of a tower moment, just came out of a sudden ending, or you guys are avoiding. You're avoiding a sudden ending by making a decision, by going within, no longer sitting, no longer riding the wave, no longer, you know, just like, okay, it is what it is. I feel like there's a, someone is stepping up to the plate here. Someone is like, you know what? I know what I got to do. You know, let's just do it. The King of Wands energy is here. Like someone here is very sure of themselves. <laughs> Definitely have an ego. Someone here is just like, you know what? I know what I want and I got to go get it. I know what I want to do, so it's time to make it happen. With my Aquarius. Someone here, like this person, they may not like come out and talk to you and tell you this is the energy they're in. You're just going to see their actions change. Be mindful of that. Especially if you're dealing with someone with earth in their chart. They're not big talkers when it comes to the emotional aspect of it. So it's like they're just going to, they're just going to shift their energy. They may have fire that stands out. This is somebody that's financially stable or very much focused on their finances. I'm also hearing, though, like you may not know that this person is as financially stable as they are. This person may act as if they don't or like, oh, man, I got to get money. Oh, man, I got to get this. Oh, I got to get that. Like, but this person is really financially stable. Like this person could be very stingy, especially if they're earth sign. This person is very stingy, so they don't spend money like that. But they know what they want. So they're going to go from being like in a king of pentacles energy of like focus on finances, finances, finances. I'm not worried. To the king of wands energy. They're coming in with a lot of passion, a lot of surety. They're coming in like, look, this is what it is. I'm going to go get it. I'm about to make it happen. <laughs> Let's do what we do. All right. They're coming to restore balance within this particular connection. Yeah. They're upgrading their energy. Good stuff and love. Let me
All right, so there was a separation again. Um, yeah. <laughs> There was a separation between you and this particular individual, okay? Um, if not a separation, it was the, the situation wasn't moving as, as it's moving now, okay? You do have reconciliation, return of a past soulmate. I told you guys, you guys were soulmates. So this is like coming in, getting this back aligned. Unexpected people, events, messages, travel, or situations. Some of you guys, this person is going to talk about marriage. Between now and like Christmas... Like, this person may say something to you about marriage. This person may propose to you, or you're going to see this person's energy shift majorly before the end of this year. New beginnings, yeah. Letting go of, like, how things were, letting go of the past energy change, moving forward, taking risks, going towards what needs to happen with this situation. Sacred sexuality, this connection has the potential for sacred ta tantric alchemy. Yeah, so you guys have, like, great sex. The person that I'm talking about, you're like, which one? Okay, if you looked at the video yesterday, now I'm just telling you guys, I'm posting, like, two videos a day, all right, on this channel. Maybe more. If Spirit come and give me another message, I'm going to put it up. So, <clears throat> last night, I posted up a video. It said, let's break down these options, right? Don't let my titles deter you. Aqua, just look at the video. But in the video, it was a quite a few options there, Aqua. <laughs> so if you dealing, you know, dealing with or got, you know, people that you're like, I wonder if it's this person, I wonder if it's that person, or who's coming back, go look at that video, okay? There's a lot of options in that video, Aqua. I, I, I can't hold you on that one. And that's, you know, that's typical Aquarius energy. Not that, you know, like I'm saying like Aquarius is not faithful because Aquarius are very faithful when they're in a relationship. But if you're not in a solid relationship, <coughs> Aquarius will keep their options open. So definitely go look at the video from yesterday, from last night that says let's break down these options. But yeah, you're going to know who this is. This person, the sex is amazing with this individual. The sex is amazing with this person. You like, <laughs> okay. Some of y'all are wondering, like, why a situation that you're in is not working. Why something is not going the way that you wanted to go with somebody. It's because there's somebody else that's for you. This person that's in your life, they were sent to teach you a lesson, right? If you're ready to move on, put I learned my lesson in the chat right now. This person was brought in as a karmic to teach you a lesson. Now, learn the lesson and move forward. There's something that's coming in. There's some type of re reconciliation that's coming in. And maybe you guys weren't ready at the time. But uh, <laughs> you are aqua. You, you ready for some good sex, honey. <laughs> that's what I'm going to Yeah, and journey at the bottom of the deck. So somebody here was living in a facade. Somebody here was living in a facade, right? And they're getting over that. They may they may have been in denial about how much they care about you. They may have been in denial about, you know, uh where this situation was going. Yeah, this destiny. This was de this was destined to be. Yeah, daughter romance, daughter spirit. Yeah. Somebody's getting in enlightenment. Somebody's going within. Somebody's like, look, I know what I need to do. Door to romance here. Yeah, somebody's giving in. Like, let me just let me just love my aqua right. Acceptance, self worth, complacency, right? So somebody could have been complacent with the energy that they were in and maybe felt as though they didn't deserve this situation. And now they're really getting, they're really realizing their self-worth, okay? This person could have been through a lot in the past. You could have been through a lot in the past. There was a lot of trickery going on. You know, dealing in situations where people weren't honest with you. People weren't, you know what I'm saying? People weren't being true. Trickery all tied up. Yeah. They're realizing, like, wait, nobody loved me like Aqua loved me. Victory. I don't even got to pull no more. Victory. You have victory here. Victory in this situation. All right? 
So it, it wasn't you. It's just like this person was not used to the energy that you're giving them. This person was not used to everything that you had to offer to them. Now they see the light, okay? Like they could have left a situation, left someone, and now they know. Like, look, let me go get my aqua. I don't know what I was thinking about or what I was doing, but let me go get my aqua. You got a reconciliation happening for you this week, Aquarius. So, um, supreme gratitude for that, all right? Whoever this person is, go look at the um, other reading that I did last night so it can help you break this down. This person could have uh, fire and earth in their chart, okay? Or they're just in that type of energy. But this person is coming back sure as hell. I shake.